Hi guys, it's Taylor. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another plan with me. I am so excited because I am finally planning for January 2020. Like, holy crap, it is here. Um, it's, I, let's see, when am I filming this? I am currently filming this on Sunday the 29th, so I am just a couple days away. Perfect timing in my book. Um, no clue how early I'll get this up, but you guys, seriously, this is so crazy. Happy New Year because it's probably the new year when I'm posting this. I just seriously can't believe it. To celebrate, I decided to put on a new cover. I was going to use the cover from the Winter Seasonal Surprise Box, if you guys know what cover I'm talking about, um, but I just could not do it. The gold with the rose gold coil was not working, working for me. So I decided to put this one on because it's just super, super cute with the gray tabs and the coil. And I love that I picked this one up. It is just so cute. I got this in my um, Black Friday haul. So love this cover. I just seriously don't even want to open it because I just can't stop looking. It's so pretty and it looks really cute with this little band. But seriously, look how thick this is getting. I still cannot get myself to pull out the back pages. This is an 18 month planner and I really do need to just tear out those last months because I'm probably not going to use them, but I feel like I want to wait until they release the new planner before I do that because I have a feeling like if I rip them out and then decide I actually do want to use this through December, then I'm going to regret it. So. I don't know. I'm going to try and keep squeezing my stickers in, but this thing is literally about to pop and I'm only halfway through it. So not even. So, okay, let's open this up and show you guys where we're at. So I don't have any plans for my dashboard. Um, I was thinking about using this for budget this year, but I'm just not sure if that's going to work for me. So we'll think about it. Um, I had really cute uses for this back in July when I first started using this planner, but it just really became kind of a nuisance to turn to and put together and it just wasn't super functional for me. So I'm probably going to leave the dashboard blank at least for now, or maybe I might use it but just not use stickers on it. Who knows? We'll see. 2020 is about trying new things, doing new things, so we shall see. All right, if you watched my haul video, you know that I did decide to go ahead and pick up Planner Kate's um, stickers for the new year. Um, I really don't know if I'm going to like them, but I really wanted to kind of let January be a trial to see how I want to plan for this year. So I did get Kit 201. This is both of the monthly sheets as well as extra appointment labels, extra patterned labels, um, thin washi, and then I did get this extra thin washi because I might use this up here instead of this one because if you watched my last video, you know I am not a huge fan of this font. Um, so I, I don't know. I don't think I'm going to end up putting it down, but we're just going to kind of start start everything and see, see how this goes. I'm a little nervous. Do you think maybe I should just put this down first and see how it is or should I just, I don't know. This is going to be interesting to see how it goes. So, ah, I'm so nervous. Okay. So if I use this, Okay, let's just lay it down and see what it looks like first. And then if I don't like it, we'll just change it. So this is supposed to fit like, ooh, maybe I should put these down first. I don't know. Let's just go for it and see how it turns out. I have a feeling I'm not gonna want to use it, but we'll see. So we put that down, which fits pretty well. And then we'll put this down. Guys, I just don't know if I'm going to like this font. It's just not like screaming my name. Okay, 
I don't know how to line this up. Like, I don't know. Let's do it this way. Okay, so that was pretty easy to put down. Hmm. I don't know, you guys. Let's see. Do I want to... Ooh, these are pretty thin, so it's not going to, like... Let's just see. <laughs> you guys, I am... Oh my gosh, yeah, you can totally see. Hmm, okay. Nope, I'm not going to like it. So, here's what I think we're going to try and do. Okay. Let's pull this up. I know, cringe, you guys are going to hate me throughout this entire video because it's just going to be me probably pulling up washi over and over because I don't like it. Um, let's just put this back down for now. Maybe we'll come back to it, but I really think I want to try just putting down the thin washi or the thick washi that's plain. And then we'll kind of see from there, like what I, what I decide I want to do. Oh gosh, that was like on there tight. Dang. Okay. This curls up so easily. Okay, I have a feeling that is not going to stay down now. Oh goodness, you guys, this is this is the stress about new kits because you just have no idea how they're going to fit and work. I think what I'm going to do. see how much room is this gonna I don't think I'll have to cut it I think it'll be fine to just put it down let's just go for it and try so if we go here and kind of just line it up right at the top that's like right at the top I did that perfectly holy crap go me okay I think I want to try it that way and then use the date headers underneath. You can like still kind of see it. I didn't quite line it up well enough, but I think it'll be okay. Ooh, I think I like that. Okay. So, okay, let's just leave that kind of sitting down. So this is going to be the tricky part, is I need to, like, flag this. So, let me find my scissors. There they are. I'm going to pull this off. Good thing I have two different ends, because in case this doesn't go well. We're going to try... Is this thinner? No, it's not. That just looked really thin. Okay, I'm going to try and cut this. Let's see how it goes. Okay, I think I kind of did it. Let's see. All right, let's see how this looks. Okay, so I'm gonna try and get this down. Maybe even a little closer. Oh my gosh, I think that's gonna work. Ooh, that's so cute. Okay, so this is gonna be the tricky part is like getting it cut and laid down properly. So, let's see if I can go in with my little blade tool and see if I can get this cut. I think I got it. 
except I think it needs cut just a little bit shorter. Let's see. Let's grab my other like little date thing here. Day header, whatever you want to call this. Is this going to look weird? I don't know. Let's see. Okay. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I don't know if this is going to cover up the way I didn't think that far ahead. I may have to go in and use white out. You guys, I'm trying. I'm trying to be creative out here. Hmm. I think that that works, except, yeah, this needs to be cut just a little bit more. So we're gonna go like this. I think that'll be okay. Now let me just move this. <laughs> You guys, I'm sorry. I'm just like trying to like get this even. So maybe we'll use, I'm scared to use white out, but I'm going to use white out. Oh my gosh, it took me forever to find white out. Okay. Let's see how this goes. I need to do this on like the back of something first. Okay, let's see if whiting that out kind of helps. Does that look weird? I can't tell. <laughs> like, I feel like it kind of looks a little weird, but I don't know. I think I kind of dig it. Maybe this should be like moved down just a tad bit more. Let's try that. So if we I think that's I think that makes it better. Even just a little bit more. So it's not like, ooh, yeah, I think I like that. Okay, let me just cut this one more time. And that should be good. Okay, there it is. I actually think I love that. I think that it turned out really cute. I like this font better than I like this font. And I just think that overall it looks really simple, but really cute. I think I'm just gonna have to throw away this sticker. I hate throwing away stickers, but this is just not, maybe I could go put this like somewhere else. Let's go. Let's go put it over here <laughs> just to like use this sticker. There. That way that sticker. <gasps> Ooh, I can use the January sticker there. That would be so cute. Okay, hold on guys. I don't know what the heck I'll use this page for, but I can go ahead and decorate it with my, with my extra washi that I have.
so we can put like that as like on the bottom <coughs> bless me I'm so sorry and then just use this down here hey that's actually really cute maybe I can just use this for I don't know something I'll come up with something that I can use there that's super cute go me look at me finding ways to utilize my stickers and then there's the monthly view I think that that's really cute actually I'm kind of excited about it okay enough chit chat let's just get it I really do not have a lot planned for January at all so apart from me experimenting with stickers this is really not going to be that long of a plan with me now the other question is do I want to use my notes thing because I feel like it's just going to kind of crowd it but I kind of want to use it at the same time hmm. let's put it down and see what it looks like again just gonna experiment I wish you guys could like tell me <laughs> like respond to me while I'm planning like yeah it looks really cute or no I don't think you should do it I don't even ever use that dang sidebar anyway so it's probably just a waste of sticker but we'll leave it for now and then we'll see how I like it but guys I think that that actually looks really cute and it's very simple and it just kind of feels like I don't know more like what I more like what I prefer um now do I want to use these down at the bottom or not what do I want to do I don't think I'm gonna use them I don't think I'm gonna make this too decorative honestly I think I'm just gonna leave this pretty simple I honestly don't even know if I'm gonna leave that sidebar sticker there but we're gonna leave it for now and then I'm not gonna put down the date dots either again I just really want to keep it simple so yeah all right let's just do this so let's start figuring out my plans for January I actually decided instead of using a sticky note to just put everything in my phone calendar and start it that way so we know that Wednesday, you guys also, this looks so different from my January spread from last year. My January spread last year was so freaking cute. Actually, sorry, this is just going to make this video so long, but I really want to show you. So this is the planner I was in at this time last year. It's the academic planner, so I had to tab it. And freaking look how beautiful my January spread was. This was like my all-time favorite Planner Kate kit. It's the kit that made me fall in love with planning, fall in love with Planner Kate, and this monthly spread was just adorable. It was so freaking cute. Isn't that so pretty? Oh, I love it. Anyways, I just kind of felt like showing you guys. And then look how different this year looks. Like, I don't know. It's kind of weird. Okay. So, continuing on. Um... Let's just start with New Year's. I'm gonna see if I have any cute New Year's stickers. Let's look in my sticker books. So I don't know if I've already used any or not. These are all blue, which is probably not gonna look good, but there's like some little hats. Those would be really cute. Let's check in this one. I think this is the one I used last year. So most of it's used. And then this is the, brand new sticker book oh but these are literally all like blue so that's probably not gonna work that's okay so i think oh i could always just have used these like if i would have covered the whole washi and then just used that that would have been cute too um okay so i think i'm gonna put this happy new year sticker maybe hmm yeah let's do I 
Okay, just kidding. We're gonna wait for the decorative stuff until after I've put in my plans. That's what we're gonna do. Okay, so no specific plans for, oh yeah, I do have a dentist appointment. Why is that not in my calendar? Okay, hold up. Okay, December, oh, that's on December 31st. So that's not on the first. Okay, I'm good. So that means Thursday is when I have an HR meeting. So <laughs> actually, let's use some thin washi to mark that there's still no school on these days. Cause that, I don't know, I kind of want to do that. So we'll do I don't know if I'm going to have enough, but we're just going to try it. So this is all no school. You guys, this plan with me is literally going to be all over the freaking place. Where are my rulers? See, I just, I can't. Um, okay, let's find a ruler. Okay, can't find one, so we're gonna use this little guy. Okay, so we're gonna rip that off and then we're gonna continue this. Actually, is that gonna fit? Oh, it totally will. Okay, so that, and then here is a little bit left to mark the sixth, or the fifth and the sixth, and then you guys, the seventh is when the kids start school, and that is when I start my official first day of teaching. Can you believe it? Oh my gosh, you guys, after all of this hard work, all of this schooling, like I'm gonna be a, a real music teacher. That's just insane. I'm so excited. Nervous, but excited. Okay, so we have Wednesday's New Year's, which I'm gonna have a cute little sticker of some sort to mark that. Um, but we're gonna put no school on there. All of this is, should I put it on a sticker? Or should I just put it? Yeah, let's put it on a little sticker. Let's do it on this one. No school. Um, you guys may have noticed too, I did not get date dots. So I know the last couple of monthly kits, I bought date dots, um, or not date dots, I'm so sorry, icons, but I just think that was kind of a waste of money. I know it was only like a dollar or fifty, but on the monthly spread, again, I just kind of want to keep it simple and not crowd it with so much stuff. Okay, Thursday is my HR meeting, so I'm going to use some of my little stickers. I have meeting stickers somewhere. I kind of wish that I had <laughs> these in a different font now, like in the font that matches these. Maybe I should just write it in my own handwriting. But I don't know. I think I'm just going to put it on here and we'll see. So I think I'm going to do like pink. Oh, these are thick. These are bigger. Let's see what I'm working with. We'll do pink is work related stuff and black is personal life stuff, I guess. That's how we'll do that. Actually, I want to use these before. I use the other stuff. 
and that is at 9 30 in the morning so i'm gonna use my sharpie pen that before I mark something. Is that crooked? It's so hard to tell. I think it is crooked. Guys, I, so I got my nails done, as you can see, which it has been a while since I got like a real manicure done. Um, but I, I love them, but I feel like it's so much harder to work with longer nails. And like, okay, does anybody else get tips and then get, so this is like the dip nail, it's not the shellac or the um, acrylic, but do you ever get your nails done and then you feel like itching, like when you scratch yourself, it's not as satisfying because that is definitely an issue I've been having lately and it is driving me insane. I feel like I cannot successfully scratch my itches. <laughs> You guys probably think I'm so weird. Okay. So meeting at 9.30 a.m. Okay. Then on the 7th is our first day of school. Oh my goodness. So we have to mark that in there. Um, first day. There it is. I'm going to use this like script one. I know I have the font ones too, but those are a little bit bigger. So I'm gonna use this first day of school sticker and I'm gonna put it on a big one because it's like a huge deal. So I'm gonna put first day and then we're probably gonna put some like balloons. Let me find my balloon stickers somewhere. Let me pull those out. Balloons, balloons, balloons. I know they're in here somewhere. Here they are. Yay. Okay. So I think we're going to use the black balloons. So we're going to put this like here. My little celebratory balloons. First day, so cute. It's crooked, but whatever. I can't, I can't get it up, but it's driving me crazy. Like my nails aren't even that long, and I cannot function with them. <laughs> I'm. Ridiculous. I'm just so used to my little stubby nails because I oh my gosh. I'm so sorry That always happens. I was not paying attention And my video recording stopped because my camera does this weird thing where if I've been like Going for so long it just stops. It's super weird, but and of course I wasn't paying attention I have no idea what you guys didn't see but I was just marking for a stay with some balloon stickers because They're hecka cute and it's a huge deal first day of school. Ah, so excited. Okay. So that's happening on Tuesday the 7th. Then on the 13th, I have my first mentor meeting that morning, which means I already have to prepare things for a sub, which I'm like, holy crap, that's crazy. So we're going to put that on again, one of these pink ones. Oh, I'll just put another meeting sticker. I keep forgetting that I have those. So meeting the 13th. And that is at 8 a.m. Eight to eleven. Okay, then let's see what else we have here. 
the 20th we have no school because it's Martin Luther King Jr. Day. So of course I want to mark that again. So we'll use another no school and we'll put it on. Oh my gosh, you guys, my stickers are all over the place. Okay. And I kind of want to do it on a different one. Let's do... Nope, I'm going to do it on the same one because that's just how I am. It's going to bother me if they're different. Those are the only two times I have no school, so. Put that on there. No school. Okay. That's important to know. Then I have... The 21st, a PTO meeting. So, uh, I think I'm going to put meeting sticker, but I'm going to leave room and write PTO so I know, like, what exactly it's for. Let's do... Yeah, I like that. And I'll just write. That's from 5.30 to 6.15. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to have, like, more meetings and stuff pop up. Um, when I get a better idea of, like, my school schedule. But for now, this is just the stuff that was, like, on the district calendar that I can go ahead and put down. Okay, so we have PTO meeting down and then the 28th, my elementary school band and orchestra concert is happening. And I definitely want to be there to support that, so um, we will put it on what do I want to put that on? Let's put it on a decorative. So let's do Some of these I feel like don't really match. Which kind of bugs me. Do I want to use this one? Is it going to look weird? I don't even feel like that's big enough to write on, but I think I'm going to do it. No, I'm not going to do it on an event label. I think I'm just going to do it on black okay I wish I had like the bigger pink ones in black that's kind of throwing me off okay let's just write it on the pink That's at 7 p.m., I think. That would make sense. Yep, 7. Since it's not like a for sure if I'll be able to go, which hopefully I will, I'm just going to put it on this smaller one. That's the 28th. Okay, then... Um, I need to mark that on the 31st, my um, teacher's conference registration ends. So I kind of just need a reminder there. So maybe that's when I can use one of these cute little asterisks. And we'll use it on a decorative box. And 
and what I don't know which one I want to use it on we'll use it on this little pot then so I'll kind of go like this let's take the black This is really hard to put on with my nails. <laughs> yeah, we'll try that. I feel like there's no brown, so it almost looks a little weird. Should I use that one? Let's use it on the lighter one. There, that's a cute little way to remind myself of that. Okay, <clears throat> so then apart from that, um, the last two things I wanted to add in um, are Biddy Beats on, so Biddy Beats is a class that I take my boyfriend's daughter to, it's a music class, every other Friday, um, whenever we have her, when she's not with her mom. So I'll be taking her on the 10th and the 24th. So we'll use the smaller skinny black hourly labels for that. and the 24th at 5 30. Sorry, it just bothers me when anything is crooked. I just can't do it. Okay. So we got baby it's in there. And then I think that that is it. I think that that's everything I know for sure that I have going on. Um, just double checking. Yeah, that should be everything you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and add a couple decorative things for New Year's because I definitely want to mark it. Um, Maybe I'll just do one of these hats and I think I have a New Year's sticker in here. But it's really big. I see New Year's Eve, but I don't have New Year's. That's kind of weird. Yeah, that's super weird. So. I guess I'm just gonna like write it on a box and I wonder if I have room to fit one of these. I don't think I do, so I think I'm gonna just put it on
there that makes it a little more festive and gets me excited for the new year so I think that I'm gonna call it quits here I think that this turned out really cute I love this font and then just kind of adding those stickers over there so they don't go to waste onto this page was a really cute idea so I'm kind of excited and we'll see how I kind of utilize that again not sure if I'm gonna use the dashboard but this I think is gonna work for me it's super simple it's really cute and it's not too crazy and also January is not too crazy of a month as far as I know so far so yeah, I think that'll be it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this plan with me. I hope it kind of gave you guys an idea of what Planner Kate's new stickers are like in this planner, even though most of you are probably already planned because m most everybody is way ahead of the game and I'm always like right on the dot or late. So um, not sure how useful this video will be to you guys, but I hope that you still enjoyed it. I can't wait to see you all in my next video, and I hope you all have a very happy new year. Bye, guys.